In this video, I will walk you through the process of optimizing your Android TV device for an exceptional entertainment experience. Firstly, we will be enabling developer mode to unleash the device's full potential. And then I'll introduce you to a fantastic app store where you can discover unique applications that might be new to you. And finally, I'll guide you through the installation of one of these remarkable applications. Prepare to embark on a journey into the world of Android TV enhancements where we will elevate your entertainment experience to a whole new level. So without further ado, let's get started! No matter your level of experience, this journey is for everyone. All you need to do is watch this video till the end and follow each step carefully for the best results. So let's not waste any more time and let's dive right in and get started. The first thing we're going to do is we're going to go to the settings gear in our Google TV, Android device, Android TV. It, this will work on any Android device based system. Hover over the system, hover over about, click on it, go all the way down. And here you will see OS built. You're going to click on it nine times and then it will tell you you will become a developer. As you can see, I'm currently already in a developer, so you will get a option added called developer options. Click on it and then you can just do a quick walkthrough of everything. We're not using this. Just a quick note. If you want to make your Android based device a bit faster, when it's get a bit slower, you can add a background process limit. I usually have it at two processes at most. Let's go back to the home screen and here's where we're going to go ahead and download an application. Once you're over apps, go ahead and search for the application called Downloader. You can also use, use your voice search Downloader. There you have it. And then you can go ahead and install it. It will download the application. After that is done, you can Results go ahead for and open Please it up. search downloader. It's going to ask you to allow access to your device. You're going to click OK. And here you're going to click on OK again. Go to the search bar and type in a code. That's going to be for today 234753. And hit search. It's going to automatically connect to the application. It's gonna download it and install it. Just a quick note, we're not actually jailbreaking anything, we're just sideloading it. Uh, this is just a term I and others use. Um, now it's gonna pop up a message saying, hey, you can't actually install it, you need to give permission to install unknown applications from this source. You're gonna click on OK, you'll be redirected to settings, then you'll click on, uh, you swipe it over and it will tell you to install it. Apparently I already have it, but that's totally fine. I'll just reinstall it. As you can see, totally fine. And you can open it up. Now you will be taken to this third party store where you can go ahead and add a library. So we're going to type in a code. Um, don't be fooled by the name. It works on Google TV. You're going to type in Fire Stick. So this is something I saw from another person who uploaded this video. Thank you so much for sharing this. It is, uh, yeah, share these applications and I would love to reshare it with my viewers. Let's go ahead and click on OK. It's going to connect us to that store. And here you'll see a quick message on it that he placed and all the applications, the best applications that you can imagine are right here in this store you have with this being with that being said fully loaded up your google tv you can go ahead and check it out there are so many applications and these are the best applications let's go ahead and do a short uh, quick demonstration on installing one of these let's go ahead and choose this right here just click on it click on download it's going to download the file, then it's going to pop up in a menu to install it. You're going to click OK, and then you need to give this application again permissions to actually download applications. This is just a one time thing. Go ahead and swipe it over, click back, 
and now you have the option to click on install click on it and that's it now it's installed as you can see that is all working that's how easy it is and that's how easy it is with all the other applications going back to the app right here you have a choice of 42 applications that probably you have never heard of or you have but you don't know how to install it right here right now this is how you do it okay just follow the steps like how i have explained it and you can make it work for yourself that being said we're coming to an end of this tutorial i hope you enjoyed it and i hope you saw the value in it thank you all for watching and i wish you a wonderful day goodbye